In the third episode, I had one problem came up, namely that the free wheel cassette removal tool was too small to tighten it properly. To avoid buying a new tool, the logical solution seems to be simply widen the existing tool. Uh, existing tool hole that wasn't an easy task. I tried to do it that manual, even above the corners a little bit faster. After excruciating filing, I completely removed the rear wheel from the bike to try it out, and yet it is still needed a bit more filing. As things always go when you put your heart and soul into something, the effort paid off and the tool fit after all. After tidying it properly, I added spacer and nuts and was ready to install back again. During that I injured myself a little, but there's nothing to worry about. The bike is nicely fixed, so I thought I would reward myself with some warm coffee. After a refreshing break, I decided to install the brakes. I use 303mm brake rotors and it's necessary to install brake adapters. Now it's time to try the torque tool that I was ordered from AliExpress. For this, I apply 6 needle meters uh, to fix the adapters. Another parcel came in, this time from Ukraine. In it are also fenders, anti-alarm gailers, engine start-stop system, uh, spare inner tubes and a missing headset spacers. During the headset installation, in the second episode I have run into a problem which was missing headset spacers. Now the missing part is there. Now I do final tightening with the torque tool. For example, on details I that I have multiple bolts. It is perfect tool to fix everything with equal strength. Install the rear braking system on the play with the spacers so the braking system would hold properly. 